Weather has improved here in Houston, Texas for the MLS Cup playoffs 2013. The Eastern Conference knockout round here at BBVA Compass Stadium on the east side of downtown. Number four, Houston Dynamo playing host to the Montreal Impact. Obviously a thing to note. And Will Brown with Giles Barnes. Barnes withdrawn much of the time up front. Will be expected to create for Andrew Wenger. And at the tip of the spear, a marksman, a talisman. He is Marco DeVaio. It is game on here at BBVA Compass Stadium. A sole survivor will be determined here tonight. So that play that just occurred, the fact that that ball made it to Tally Hall. Zarkoti, that's good delivery. Clark gets up, but pounds his header right at Troy Perkins. This is one of our keys in the open, is to get the outside backs for the Dynamo involved in the attack. Kofi Sarkoti is coming to his own this year, getting forward. His crosses have been very good, providing the Dynamo opportunities. Again, there's Ricardo Clark pushing a little bit higher because Warren Creval is sitting so deep. That allows Ricardo Clark a little bit more freedom in the attack. And I think that's okay with the Dynamo because, again, they're defending with at least four at all times to make sure they don't get countered. They know that Montreal is going to sit in and try to do that. Wilbrun deep in midfield. It slipped into Clark. Try to line up his right. his playoffs so the referees have to be very careful should I, be gone it depends on which side of the fence you fall are you blue or are you orange your arms up way too high it's got to be a red card yellow card brought to you by center point energy wenger the bio is on he gives it to DeVaio, a chance to make it two to one. He tries to chip Tally Hall. Hall makes a save and makes himself big. There was nowhere to go for DeVaio. 
So there's a huge play from Tally Hall measuring his angles perfectly. Montreal's had a couple of chances in this half, both from bad giveaways by the Dynamo, this time by Boniat Garcia. This is what Montreal is looking for. Again, we talked about, we just spoke about Tally Hall and the big saves that he makes, the timely saves that he makes. Mark that one down. The Vios won it back, top of the box, he's going to let fly, the Vios shot, save Tally Hall. Montreal thought that was their way back in the game, and again, it's loose defending here, sloppy play leading to chances for Marco De Vios. I think that Warren Craval there could give that to Tally Hall for an easier clearance. Marco De Vios always sharp, always looking for a quick turnover. The attacking players try to get loose, it's a foul. I don't understand it. Case in point there. Rivas went up, wow. led, led with his arm again. Game. And he's gone. So we uh, kindly called that one. Well, Nelson Rivas' season goes 70 minutes. And you'd have to say uh, behavior not necessarily professional here tonight. When you're in the playoffs, I mean, you have to be smarter than this. <laughs> you, as, a, well, as a defender, you get your arms up. You get that man? You get your arms up to protect yourself as a defender. But the elbows that he has given today, the impact and the source of impact. So is he getting sent off for that, which didn't look as bad on the replay? Or is he getting sent off for his persistent fouling here tonight? It's not the first game he's ever been sent off in. Ferrari, Will Bruin showing a turn of pace. Justin Mapp's header, swept away by Tally Hall to the feet of Brad Davis. Sarkoti, he's made the right back position his own. And that'll probably do it. Pure frustration from Andreas Romero. DeVaio gets in there. And this is where Houston's got to be very careful. They don't want to lose anybody for the New York Red Bulls semifinals. And you talk, this for me right here is classless from Montreal. DeVaio's getting run out of there. By four sports. guys. Four sports, DeVaio. There you go. He should be sent off now. Four sports, Montreal. Sore losers. Dominic Kinnear knows that uh, anything rash here would cost him a player for the New York Red Bulls. That's the main concern here. Romero should be disciplined. DeVaio should be disciplined. This is a joke. Well, DeVaio's gone, so is Andreas Romero, so they are disciplined. That kick from Romero that triggered it all. Keep an eye on the bio's right hands. Not just there. It happens again. There you go. He's scratching him too. And that's it. Rightly so. Mark Geiger blows the whistle. The Houston Dynamo are on their way to the semifinals of the Eastern Conference to take the New York Red Bulls on.